Hey everyone, welcome back to Routine Hub. Today we'll be taking a quick look at a, one of my favorite shortcuts of the week. So if we go check it out here, it's called File Share, Anonymous File Sharing. This one is from author 5lit on Routine Hub. We will link their profile in the description, so be sure to check out all of their work here. So if we get started here, it allows you to anonymously share some files. So let's check out how it works. So if we go back here, check out the documentation. You can upload and download any files with the shortcut. It uses the, uh, an API from file.io of uh, the store and receives files using the key or a QR code. And we'll dive into how that works in just a second. We'll go through this on our own, but be sure to check this out and leave some feedback here for the this awesome uh, developer Fivelet here. So of course, press get shortcut, which I already did. Open my shortcuts app, file share, here it is. So if you go ahead and press it to run, you'll see it pops up in a menu, upload or download. I'm gonna press upload. What I'm gonna upload can be anything from your photos app or your files. I'm gonna upload this um, Jelly Cuts documentation that I had saved here from a while ago, zip file. Um, this is really cool because now you can select a unit of time. I'm gonna go with a day and the next pop-up menu will have a number set. So when you select a day, and then the number corresponding to the day, that's how many days this file will be available. So if we click three days, the file will now be available via the link or QR code for three days. Awesome, so if you see here, there's my key. I'm gonna take a screenshot of this real quick. Uh, you can copy to clipboard, you can share it, you can create a QR code or view the full server response. I'm gonna create a QR code and I'm gonna save it to my photos beautiful so you see here in your photos now you'll have a QR code this is the most recent one just did that one so you should be able to now open this QR code so if I go back to file share and instead this time I press download I should be able to select a QR code input from photos is one I just saved which will be this one Always allow, of course, always allow these. And it should return me my zip file of the Jelly Cuts documentation. And as you can see here, once you scan the QR code with a different device and open the link, it'll take you to the file.io page uh, with the download link. And as you can see there, it is set to expire on October 9th, 2024 which is in three days, exactly as I specified in the shortcut. Really cool stuff. So if we go back here, huge shout out to author 5lit on Routine Hub. Be sure to check all the other work out and we'll see you on the next shortcut roundup. Thanks so much.